Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your queen, divine mother, goddess Yamaya, and I am coming to you all as your intuitive guide. I will be um, doing a reading for you all for today. This is going to be a daily reading for August 23rd for my Cancerians or my Cancer Babes. Thank you, kings and queens, for stopping in. I hope you can like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. If you are a returning viewer who has not yet subscribed, please do so at this time. I really appreciate your support. <clears throat> so before even going in, I am getting my throat chakra messed with. Someone is definitely trying to bother me in my throat chakra. But I am going to continue with this message for you all. So excuse me if I have to stop and drink some water, drink some tea, like I am now. <laughs> we have a chariot card out here. So someone is um, planning to come towards you. They um, see you as someone who they either want to work in a group with you or someone who is working in a group against you. Take this story as it fits, only you know your story. And if you have not yet found this out, this is something that is taking place in your near future, or this could have been something that has happened in your past. Someone could also want to collaborate with you as well. And they could see you as someone who's inspirational, someone that they would like to work with. Or this could be a third party situation where there's two or more people involved in the situation. And someone is not willing to let go of this situation. They've had a hard time letting go. Things are headed in the wrong direction for this person and they're continuing to go through with it. Someone who is coming towards you also wants to have growth with you. They want to start something new with you. They are seeing you at a new beginning or they want to have a new beginning with you. They see you as someone who's abundant. This could also be someone who is trying to or one of these group of women or one of these group of people could be someone who is um, stuck trying to figure out who they are. They could be blinded to um, a situation that is taking place at this time or that has occurred that they have no um, understanding of. A king of wands is involved in this situation. So um, I'm definitely getting that someone is <laughs> a sexual person who has been having encounters with different women or groups of women of different nationalities this is someone who is um, of the water signs or no i want to say i see water back there but this will also be um earth as well which is like a gemini aquarius libra This group of women could be of those three signs or those three signs could be in your chart or one of those three signs could be a part of this group of women who either want to work with you or work against you over a man who's involved in the situation who could have had you all in a third party situation. And when I say third party, it's just like this man could have been dating all of you at the same time. You could be related. You could be cousins, friends. We have an eight of pentacles. So someone is really hardworking. You could be someone who's really hardworking at this time. You're focused on your bag. You're fo focused on getting your things together. And someone is trying to fuck with you. I heard that coming out of my mouth. But I tried to refrain from saying it. Um, someone actually wants to possibly have sex with you. And that could have been the F word I was getting ready to say as well. Um, as far as this player who also sleeps around with a lot of women. This could be someone who's... Um, working really hard to come towards you or trying to attempt to have a relationship with you, build some type of romantic relationship with you. This person is looking at 
the Empress, the Divine Feminine. I would hope a player is not trying to come towards the Divine Feminine. They need to leave y'all where the hell they at. We have the Eight of Swords. Someone is not willing to let go or face themselves. They could be going through the dark night of the soul, which is where they are definitely trying to find themselves. They are coming in towards you. They see, they have clarity um, about who you are. They understand who you are at this time. And they want to move in towards you. You are someone who could have walked away from this person. And this person is trying to get you back. The Eight of Cups. This person definitely wants you back. And they're coming in. And they're coming in now. Or they could be coming in really, really soon to try to win you back. This person um, could be someone that is a um, fire sign, a Sagittarius Leo Aries. Um, they could want to write you to let you know how they feel about the situation, about you um, walking away from them. Or they could have just recently gotten new. It could be a different scenario where someone... Um, just got some information some new information that they've recently found out about or discovered um they could have um not known the real you or the person the the person who they perceived you to be could have been a false mass of who they thought you were someone could have told them um things about you that was wasn't true and now they're finding out um the information that is the truth They've been possibly looking you up um, to figure out who you are um, with this page of swords. They've been enlightened. And so since they have, they are moving away from the people who have lied to them, made them believe something that wasn't true. They're walking away from these people. They're walking into a new direction. They're walking towards you or they may want to come in and live with you. They are definitely letting go and leaving behind um, things that do not serve them at this time. You are someone that is the eight of pen uh, the queen of pentacles. I'm so sorry. I want to say the eight of pentacles is out here already, but you are someone who yeah is a hard worker. You're someone who is giving, loving. You're a healer. You could have healed this person and helped this person to become a better person. Especially because you're the empress, you're the divine being. So it's like, I always help people out. I always make people better. I always force people to look within themselves and become a better person. And to leave bad things behind. This person could have been um, stuck trying to make a decision or trying to figure out what was the best um, move for them to make when it comes to you. Um... Just because they didn't understand you or you were like someone who was totally different from the type of people that they're used to um, being around or conversing with. Um, but they definitely know who you are now and they want to um, pretty much make an attempt to come towards you. They want to, um, they've been thinking about you. They've been um, seeing you for who you are, especially with this new information that they found out. Um, they definitely want to come and spend time with you, learn you more, see what you can teach them as well. See what you have to offer them as far as intellect. They want to indulge in your intellect. Um, this is someone or you are someone who is of light. I'm going to say that this is you. You're someone who's of light. You're someone who has psychic abilities. This was a player. Or this person is in the energy of a player. And you're going to change that about this person. Just because... You are in the higher form where you're like a natural healer, so you can ba basically change this person's ways. This is someone who's been watching you, looking at you on the internet. Someone could be watching you on your social media, on one of your platforms, um, be it Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, you know. Um, it could be Snapchat. It could be anything. It could be Tinder. I don't know. This is someone who definitely... Um, is looking at you as someone who is not who they thought you were. This is someone who you could have possibly met on the internet as well or dated at a short period of time um, from a far distance. This is someone who sees you as really abundant, someone who sees that they can have a happy life and relationship with a really um, good family dynamic where you guys can help each other to grow and become better people. 
they um, are someone who has someone in their ear who are you are someone who has someone in your ear who is trying to create problems trying to tell this person lies about who you are so that they can walk away from you because they're leaving toxic situations in the past and whoever this is on this phone call um, or is writing them they are trying to create a problem an issue this is a queen of swords a person who is um, really defensive someone who is really deceptive someone is who is clever with their words um, really manipulative she could be trying to manipulate this knight of cups Trying to blind them to the facts of who you really are. Trying to get them to see them um, as someone that they could possibly not be. We have these cards that fell out. I am not going to take them all. I'm just going to take the page of the cups. So we just took like, it was like seven cards that fell out. I just way too many um, for this reading. Um, we have the page of cups. Someone has been enlightened to you. They know new information that they definitely want to um, relate to you and let you know that they're aware of. They could have found something out that was a new discovery about you or about um, some information that they have been told about you that wasn't true, that they now understand is not true. Um, this could be someone that um, is a leader of the community, someone who helps a lot of people out, someone who is a giver, someone who could um, definitely be someone who is um, a family person, someone who um, like, loves to hang out with um, children, someone who helps out with children in some type of way. They could be a volunteer for children. Um, this could be someone who's a coach um, or someone who is a teacher just in general who hangs out with kids a lot or is around children a lot. He could, if he's a father or a father figure, he could hang around his children or be around his children at all times or a lot of the times when he is around them, he watches them really closely. We have someone who is definitely trying to um, be seen as well as trying to win, um, who is in competition at this time with you. They want to be seen. They're trying to put up a fight to prevent um, this um, Knight of Cups from coming towards you. So they are working with someone else, working with two other people to come against you. Or they would like to work with you and another person to come together. They um, probably just have one more option um, in store at this time in order for them to try and come in um, or to have this person not be with you. <laughs> this person is definitely in competition with you and they want to write you on the internet or they're watching you on the internet with these other women. This person is someone who um, is really argumentative. Um, they're someone who loves to start um, problems and um, create um, false illusions. They are really nosy as hell and they like to reach out to people to start problems. This could be a dark-skinned woman or a dark-skinned woman. This could be a woman um, that is at a distance or someone who is um, into tarot or someone who um, get readings from tarot. This could be someone um, that is a Gemini, um, Libra, Aquarius, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. And then we have the Queen of Wands, which is someone who um, has just discovered the truth and is trying to create, like I said, a false illusion. I'm just going to get one more card and we're going to close out this reading. Um, we have the Three of Cups. This person could be lying to these group of women about who you are. Or they could be under a, free, um, a false pretense of who you are. Um, something about free. Maybe they could be trying to get a free ride off of you or the person that they're dealing with. And you might be in the way. <laughs> Temperance. You are a healer. You are someone who um, 
who have who, who knows what's going on you see this coming whatever it is that they're trying to do you already know that it's happening you um these people are celebrating they could be either celebrating too early or you could be someone who is celebrating um soon someone um, could want to come towards you um and um celebrate with you yeah someone wants to come towards you Someone wants to move away from all of this drama and come in towards you to um, have a more fulfilling and happy, um, you know, have a happy living situation. I'm not, you know, I do see Ten of Pentacles where it's like you guys could be in a, um, could create a family together or they could come towards you. This could be a family person who comes towards you with kids. And would like to, like to get your help for you to help to raise their kids. Because so they see you as a person who is um, really spiritual, really gifted, really blessed. An earth angel. Someone who gives back a lot. Someone who works with kids. Who's really good with kids. And someone is not happy about the situation. They're really upset about it. And they're this... this um, Queen of Wands person definitely wants to create problems with you in drama. They think that they have all of the answers. Um, this is someone who does magic for sure with all these candles and black, this black cat around. This is someone who believes in omens and things like that, who could be a part of a occult. Someone who feels like they have the last word, who is like a leader of a group of a occult or um, casting illusions or spells over um, a group of people or, you know, their friends, which is where those three of cups came in at or those group of women could be doing it to you or against this person who is coming in towards you. It could definitely be black magic involved in this situation. This person um, believes that they um, are a magician, that they know how to... Um, cast spells this is someone who um, partakes in rituals this person could have short hair or this person um, hair could be falling out this is definitely a dark skinned woman they could possibly have dreads or braids You guys could be two different races or be two totally different people. This person is definitely in competition with you. They see you as someone who is very vibrant, someone who's totally different from them. You could be really classy the way you carry yourself. This this could be a plain Jane type of person, the person who um, doesn't like you, the ringleader of this chaos. So, yeah. That is what I have for you on today for my Cancerians. I hope this is enlightening for you. This may be a specific read for just a, a selective amount of people or just one person. Um, but um, take this information if it belongs to you um, and be careful with how you handle it. Um, be mindful of people who are trying to come up against you, trying to um, write you, um, be it a text message, be a phone call, be it an email, be it a DM. Someone could definitely be reaching out to you soon in the really near um, future, um, within about a week or so or less. Sometime this week, for sure. This person is um, that's contacting you has been watching you and watching you really closely. They do not like what they see. They are really jealous of you. You irritate the hell out of this person. They don't like your light. They don't like who you are as a person. It bothers them. They see you as someone who sits abundant and it bothers them. They could have just gotten kicked out of a home, could be on their way to a family member's house or a friend's house or a shelter. They could also be having to sleep in their car or they could need a new car. Something could have happened to their car recently. They could have recently gotten in a fight with friends and family members. They could have gotten jumped. 
This is a know-it-all. This person looks into information and thinks that they know it all, but they don't really know what they think they know. They could try to get information and go and tell people the information that they found out as if they know. They, they could read like a bit of, of some information and all of a sudden feel like they have all of their information that they need. And then the information that they're taking in is not the correct information that is important. But that is what I have for you for today. If you are resonating with this read, please like and subscribe to my channel. I hope that you have a great and prosperous day. And be on the lookout for conniving, backstabbing, annoying ass people. Ignore those messages, guys. Have a good day. Bye.